your worries, your life! For them it is all mere spectacle! Let's just say you're right. So what? Should I just gouge out my optics? Thanks, but no thanks. You are beyond salvation. But not the children of the future! Life untainted by surgery of the sacrilege! We can yet save them! May the mothers shield their bodies! May the fathers instill their hatred for Chrome! But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, our tears, on full display! A real conspiracy guy? Like in that show! Wait, get next to him. I'll snap a still of you arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late! Jessica will, like, die when she sees this. Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? Humble. <laughs> Sounds affordable. Just don't spend it on stupid shit. Thank you. This has bought me a day or two. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold.
like we found the last honest cop in this city. Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. Okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. T-Buck sent me. Said you'd have something for me. You're V, right? She had me hold the demon for you. It should work on any third-gen deck. Okay. Glad to grab a demon, always. You could test it now. I have an access point. If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shimsoft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way. Hey there, baby. I can give you what no brain dance ever could. Seen her around? Depends. Your cop? Nope. But the lady I'm looking for is. That tooth faced bitch. You want a confession out of me? It's gonna cost you. I don't do nothing for free. No way. Hmm, whatever. Nowhere to find me. I'm ready. Your daddy? Stomach's rumbling. Let's see what you got. Oh. Ever seen this woman? I sell food, and and I just want to keep selling food. That is all I will say. Uh, hey, 
How's it going? Looking to buy some new iron. A few dozen pounds. Well, be my fucking guest. Those your threads, or did you borrow them? Who the hell's asking? I'm a backer. Well, well. Two nomads crossing paths in Night City. How can I help? Looking for this lady. Know her? The badge? Sure do. She's got a room in this here motel. Right over there. Perfect. Thanks. Don't mention it. Hey! I'll call my brother. Drink a hundred for me?
are, aren't you? I know where I'm gonna strike before I do it. Here for a fight. Which one of you's my guy? Me. Wasn't expecting a tag team. But whatever, I guess. So, who do I got first? No, no. You don't get it. That body and this one. I'm the same person. So, what? I'm seeing double? I used to be twins, which you could probably guess. The twins had a close bond. But they wanted to be closer. Stronger. So they installed neural oscillation sinks. And now they're, well, me. me. One, One person, person two, bodies. two bodies. My bodies do everything together. Everything. You really do everything together, even under the sheets. I have one girlfriend for both bodies, if that's what you're asking. Shared between both. So, what? One takes waist up and the other's on booty duty? No, she's with one body Monday through Wednesday and the other Wednesday through Sunday. Frick. Whatever. Oh, and if another one of you pops up, I don't mind beating a third ass. You got a sharp tongue, no doubt about it. Let's see how that helps you when fists start flying. So, so can, can we, we get, get started? started? Show me what you got. Better than one. And four fists are better than two. Feel free to try me again if you ain't scared. Whatever. Oh, and if another one of you pops up, I don't mind beating a third ass. You got a sharp tongue, no doubt about it. Let's see how that helps you when fists start flying. So, so can, we can we get, get started? started? Show me what you got. Two heads are better than one, and four fists are better than two. Free to try me again if you ain't scared. I guess it fucked you two up. Not you two. It's just me. And where's the sportsmanship? Sheesh.
heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me. For a few reasons, there are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. What if I get a tip about a possible body? attack, what I'll give you a call. Means? Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. This is Night City. No one's got a soul to lose. Mock as you will, unbeliever! You shall see who laughs last as you're engulfed in hellfire. Satan himself! Laughs? See, now I'm skeptical. I heard the runner who wrote that Satan demon gave him a weak sense of humor. You ask, who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? No one's asking. And I answer you, the Techno-Necromancers of Alpha Centauri! Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? some sort of test eh, just a pet topic of mine you mean Help? riddles no way no mr v sorry ontology I, I, no. all right listen close scanning a serious job now playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home hang on i got a question of my own now why all this, Dex? Why me? Could've had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could've just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. 
Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is going to be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life? Or a blaze of glory. Hmm? Later now.
Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had to switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. My nose to the ground. It's the mound. It's the
telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced the convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nuh-uh. Not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Calm the Fuck down! I just want to talk! Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? <laughs> yep. Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep, now. Now listen, please. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Never met anybody named Gilchrist. That the poor fucker right there? It's true, doesn't know him. That said, I've jumped a few convoys in my day. Know all the usual suspects. Bet I can help find your mole. But what I know now won't get you anywhere in that respect. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> him you can let go. Want to hear what he has to say? You know, I could help patch the gaps in your convoy security. Prevent a repeat of this fiasco. Nope, not interested. Let's hear your offer. I don't have all day. I need a bot. Flathead mob. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money.
Sounds solid enough. I'm in. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck right. me. Anyway, Eddie's on the bridge of Queen. Real soon. Quickly. 
There you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Then an arch? Oh, damn. What a beaut. Yeah, got her cheap, too. Dorset job dividend. Hmm. I don't know how you could scrape together enough for that beast. Even used. Well, I, I took out a loan, but muy pequeñito. But I mean, it's totally worth it. So Dex Hello. already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You skin yet? You got a plan? Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Forget it, Jack. It would be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast then? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? Want to talk to Royce. Dex sent us. You know what they want, how they get it. I don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like that. Hey, what was in there? A Militech truck. But those cabrones only swiped a couple crates. Not a whole fucking semi. about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. That's Militech, all right. Psycho Borgs, chromed out with military-grade hardware worth millions.
anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You'll deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah. You talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. You fucking dead. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Jack, sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on, gotta lighten up. Take a hit. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, straight edged princess. Here we go. The flathead. Model MT Zero D twelve. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm-hmm. Could lose your lunch. So 
What you think? Yep, we'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? You're Go fucking brick, deaf! Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Asked you a question. Relax. Got him right here. Just like that! Without batting a fucking eye! <laughs> Want it or not, I got places to be. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> Maybe he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you gonna consider my offer now? Sirk. Here's the cred. Hell, I'll even toss in some info as a friendly bonus. Militech's on to you. They're close. Wait, what? Cred chip was spiked with a virus. Don't worry. I wiped it. Check it. Take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Ask Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you gonna consider my offer now? I don't wait! Bang. Bring it, cocksuckers! Unload on me! Unload! Where they come on?
the gear. Spot and control side. Quick! We out of here. Said, bot and controller. Let's go. The quicker the better. Let's get out of here. We're dying. Production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
Ladies and gentlemen, Jackie Will. Gentlemen, Jackie Wells.
down.
esperando. Detonator. Armed.
expect to see me here. You know, I like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us. Be more than glad to. Till next time then, V. Corporate gods willing. Oh, thought about what you said. About convoys, transport security. Your offer? We're just not interested. Secure the area! Time we were on our way, Kanan. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. Thanks, Jack. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh... Hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know? We're good together. I like how we do things. I do too, V. I do too. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Ahí luego, V. Looking, Mr. V. Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course it was trouble. Boys couldn't have given two shits at you and Brick had shaken on him. How'd you get him on board? You use the Corpo woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch from Maelstrom. So you paid for the flathead with Corp cash? No. Decided I could use the Eddies myself. And I just grabbed the bot. Just like that? Not just. Had to use violence. You got some balls, Mr. B. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm -hmm. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker'll be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck.
54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan, and here's what's happening in the world today. The last active photovoltaic solar farms have been decommissioned in Nevada and Utah. Solar power generation, once seen as the future of clean energy in America, has suffered significant setbacks in today's more extreme climate. The layer of dust suspended in our atmosphere, a result of the Himalayan wars, has limited the... So smart, yet so boneheaded.